Hey guys, it's Katie, and today I have a jewelry haul for you guys. Believe it or not, it is actually very easy to buy jewelry online and get addicted to buying jewelry online, I would know, because unlike clothes, like jewelry is always the same size usually, unless you're buying like rings or if you have really small wrists like me, uh, but usually like you don't have to worry about like, you know, what number pant size am I and like what, how big will this fit me and will it look right, you know, it's just, it's jewelry. So I have a couple different websites I want to introduce to you guys in this video that you guys might have not have heard of before. So the first website is Jewelry Factory and they sent me this box. They had me pick out some pieces to show you guys and I'm going to give my 100% honest opinion up front right now. Uh, Jewelry Factory, they have very cheap prices and I definitely think that you pay for what you get from this company. I'm going to be completely honest. I think that they could have better quality pieces. I mean they're pretty, I'll wear them all the time, but I want you guys to know it's not like Michael Kors or anything like that. Whatever. Anyway. so. <laughs> So the first thing that I got from there is this little bag. It's probably going to be like my makeup bag for school, just like to throw some like lip gloss and stuff in. Um, and this looks like a long champ bag, sort of, to me, so I just picked it up. It's navy blue. This silver necklace, and it comes with matching earrings, and they're spikes. And I try to get stuff that's like really in right now, and I think spikes are pre pretty in, at least in my opinion. And so it's just this silver, and it has these like sparkly little, little uh, disco ball things on there. It was $10. These feel like they're plastic though. It's this wrap bracelet, and this was $9. And it's, okay, this is what it looks like. What is going on? So this is what it looks like completely like untangled wrap it up it becomes a little bracelet like this on the website it came in like so many different colors I got the black and the white pearls and it's just a wrap bracelet so the next thing is this bracelet and this is actually pretty high quality I actually like this it feels really like nice quality to me and it looks like this it's rainbow and has gold accents and I'm really into gold jewelry currently it just slides right down there and rests right there and it looks kind of like Egyptian to me almost like in a way this is the piece that I'm most excited about and it looks like this it's this like silver spike bracelet that has little diamond spikes and like regular it kind of reminds me of the bracelet I already got from Forever 21 in my last Forever 21 haul but it's a little bit different of course and it is silver and I love it I think this is like about eight dollars these little floor de lee floor de lee earrings Oh, is it upside down? Okay, they are upside down here. Sorry, the viewfinder is really hard to look in. I actually already opened these just to see what they'd be like. Um, I really didn't like them. They're just like stud earrings that are um, little spikes. Where's the front? Like little spikes. There's two of these in here. But I really didn't like them on, so I don't recommend those. These earrings remind me of the Tory Burch um, symbol or like the logo. Like with the Tory Burch flats and all that that the, all the gurus are into now. So I saw these and I'm like, wow, these are totally knockoff. But I really love them, so I got them. And then they also were very sweet and threw in this little goodie bag with little nail polishes. So that was all I got from JewelryFactory.com. So the next website that I got a story from is ElliotFrancis.com. And Elliot Francis, that's a pretty extravagant name. I'd say like, I mean, Elliot Francis. I picture like some sort of British accent or something. They have very quality jewelry on their website. Like versus Jewelry Factory and Elliot Francis. There's a very big difference. Elliot Francis is more of like a exotic feel to their jewelry, if that makes sense. Um, the first one that I want to show you guys is the Chrome Double Zero. They actually have the names on the little cards, like, attached. This is the first one. It's a bracelet, of course. And the great thing about this website is they have really small bracelets for people with small wrists. See if I can get it on me. <laughs> so anyway, I just undid it for you guys so you guys can see the full effect, and it looks really cool. It's very, like, futuristic. If I was one of the Jetsons or something, do you remember that show? I'd probably wear this. Like, it's very futuristic. So the next thing is the Wonder Woman cuff, and this is so cool. Like, I've always wanted to be Wonder Woman. Like, I think I'll be her for next Halloween. And it's just a cuff with a little diamond in the center, and it's really pretty, very polished and it could just rest right on top of my other bracelet and look really just like chic, you know? So the cool thing about this is it has a little code on it, one of those code things, a uh, code, I forgot what they're called, but if you have the app on your phone, you can just take a picture of it and it'll take you to the website to buy this. So how cool is that? So cool and very futuristic, right? So um, I really love this cuff and it's this necklace. It's like a chain. It's like a collar. So right now it doesn't really look like it because I'm holding it funny, but Basically, it's like a collar that's made out of like a gold chain, and it's called the Collar Necklace. 
you know, go figure. So I thought that was really cool. This uh, stretchy bracelet that looks like this. It has all these different colors and it looks like a little leaf on there kind of. And it's called the Aurora Borealis 73. It's iridescent glass. All their things are handmade and really, really cool. So next are these two bracelets that look really similar, I'd say. I think they're meant to be like stacked on top of each other. And this is the Chrome 21, so it's more simple. And this one is the Chrome 26. So you guys can see. And I especially told this website um, to send me only gold pieces or things that have gold, but I really like the silver contrast. Next is this cute little gold chain with a little leaf on it as well. They have a really big thing for leaves, I guess. And this is the gold 19. And it's a gold plated leaf on a delicate gold chain. And it's all gold plated. Next is this rose gold bracelet that just has all these rose gold little um, beads on it. I don't know what shape those are, uh, but it says that it has Czech rose gold fire polished glass and it has rose gold plated hardware and it's called rose gold 38. That's the number. Next is this gold bracelet. It's just a gold chain again, but it has this little diamond on it or whatever this is called. The Swarovski crystal charm, it says. I thought that was so cool. It just gives a little, you know, little bling on your wrist. And then this one is called the Amethyst 19 and it just has these gold beads with the gold plated hardware little uh, chain again. So I thought that was really simple and cute. And then there's this one last thing that I was very excited about and something funny is I actually just ordered um, off of Jewel Mint because I really love Jewel Mint. Like these same, am I out of focus? Yeah. I ordered like the same exact thing in a different color off of Jewel Mint and then I saw this on their website and I'm like wow like it'll be like battle of the uh hand whatever these things are called. I never know what to call these things, um, but they call it the Chrome 01. So if you guys are looking on the website, and this is always really hard for me to put on. It's like, you just put this part on your wrist and there's this like random like thing dangling. You just stick your middle finger through the rest of it and it looks like this. Here, it's kind of messed up, let me fix it. So isn't that the coolest thing? Like it's kind of getting weighed down when I turn my hand to the side, as you guys can see. It's basically just jewelry for your entire hand. So not just your wrist, your, you know, your whole hand gets a little bit of flavor to it. It has gold plated hardware and a double-sided Swarovski diamond crystal charm in the center right here. So as you guys can see, it is double-sided. How cool. I'll probably just keep it on for the rest of the video just because, I mean, why not? So that is all the jewelry that I got online. Um, from those specialized jewelry websites or whatever you'd like to call them. So the second to last thing I want to show you guys is this really cool watch that I got from eBay. It's actually a Aurora Geneva watch, if that gives you any help at all on how to get this. I thought it looked very expensive even though it is not because I really just wanted a rose gold watch. And I saw this one on eBay and it was very cheap, it was only like $15, so I was like, wow, it works, it's rose gold, so I have to get it. And it was a top seller, and I promise you I am not addicted to eBay, as much as it may seem, I'm not. And it is really cool, it has like diamond studs all around it, and I just thought it was really cute. And all the gurus and everybody's all like obsessed with their arm candy and stuff, so I was like, I guess I have to get a watch that actually works, because I have so many watches that are just like broken and I got from like garage sales and stuff but this one is a actual watch that works and it it ticks and it's cute and then lastly I want to thank one of my subscribers who sent me a cute little bracelet from her new Etsy website which is called purity 12 and she actually wrote me a little letter and look how cute that is oh my god so she sent me this and I want to show you guys how cute it is um, it's just this blue little friendship bracelet with little beads in it and it's just this really pretty blue color it reminds me kind of of like snow and winter and it was really cute so thank you so much Katie uh, for making this for me I really appreciate it so you guys can check out her Etsy website which is purity12 so that is all for my haul so thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys all very soon bye